Hello all and welcome back to CFC News. Make sure you like and subscribe for daily Chelsea content. So after a slow start to the transfer window for the Blues, things are really starting to heat up. A few days ago, Chelsea announced their first summer sign-in in Raheem Sterling, who signed a five-year contract arriving from Premier League rivals Manchester City. Not only have Chelsea signed the Jamaican-born English national winger, the London side have all but completed the signing of Koulibaly, who's set to join the rest of the squad in the US for pre-season training in the next few days. It's clear to a lot of fans that these two players will be in the first team and will no doubt help the Blues in their hopes to win the Premier League next season. It is apparent after today's reports come from Fabrizio Romano that the new Chelsea owner will want to also look at building for the future. The Italian journalist stated that the London side have been interested in two Premier League youngsters, the first of which being 18-year-old former Brighton youth left-back Zach Sturge. Zach left Brighton after three successful years with the club, playing a vital role in defence and winning the 2021 Under-17 Premier League Cup. He's currently a free agent after letting his contract expire at the end of last season, which can only be a bonus for Chelsea, considering how much English players cost in the current transfer market. The second Premier League youngster that looks set to join the Blues is Amari Hutchinson. Hutchinson currently plays for Arsenal in the Under-23 team, and was initially set to sign an extension with the Gunners, but after a breakdown in talks, he looks set to join his London rivals. Amari Hutchinson is an 18-year-old English-born midfielder who has been capped by Jamaica in a 6-0 loss to Catalonia. He first stood out at the young age of 12 when taking part in a South London tournament hosted by Brazilian legend Pele, who praised Hutchinson on his skills. So guys, what do you think of these transfers? I personally think it can only be a positive, adding two highly sought-after youngsters to our already amazing youth team. Comment your thoughts down below.